Welcome back, nature enthusiasts. My name is Mark Sharp, and I'm the Education Programs Coordinator out here at Powell Gardens, and I have something special for you. It's nasty, it's gross, it's smelly, and it's slimy. It is all about decomposition. We have decomposers for you. Now, decomposers are important. They take all the dead and decaying material, plants and animals, and they return those nutrients back into the soil to grow new plants. Now, we love decomposition so much that I even have pet worms out here. I have a bin with red wigglers. I give them my apple cores. I give them uh, parts of peppers and lettuce and, and peels. And they do all of the dirty work. They break it down and give us fertilizer. It's also all worm poop. Now what we also get is what we call worm tea. And you can use this worm tea as liquid fertilizer on plants to grow healthy plants. Now the worm bin isn't the only place you're gonna find worms. In fact, at your home, uh, you will find worms outside in your yard, backyard, garden beds. We want you to grab a shovel and dig in. In fact, I just dug some holes looking for, looking for worms. And once you find those worms, there's a lot of fun things that you can do. We recommend tracing them with a crayon on a piece of paper. If you wanna get really adventurous, you use beet juice and you can make a worm painting. You can do a little bit of an experiment. You can figure out what end is the head, what end is the tail. Just a tip, the tail end is gonna have something special come out of it. You can give it light, give it dark, see what it prefers. You can give it different produce. You can give it different types of soil. Just have fun, but please treat the worms with respect there. Now, if you're really curious about your, the health of your soils and how many decomposers you have, we have something very fun for you to try. And it's a long-term kind of activity. It's called soiling your underpants. So I have a pair of 100% cotton underpants here. And all you do is you dig a hole in the yard that you wanna test uh, the health of. You put it in, you bury it up. Let the ground do the work or the decomposers. Give it 30 days, dig it back up, see how many holes it has. If it has a lot of holes, that means you have great decomposition going on. Put them back in, bury them up, pull them back out in another 30 days, two months later, and see how many more holes you have. If you don't have any holes and just a few brown marks, then you probably don't have healthy soils. So you can test the health of your soils, front yard, backyard, garden beds. Let us know how it goes for you at home. We'll let you know how this pair is doing and have a great day. Thanks for joining us.